office. May I help you? Uh, yeah. Hi. My name is Terrence Stansberry. Hi, Terrence. Hi. How are you? I'm doing great. How about yourself? Man, I'm going to tell you what. When I woke up this morning and I went on to the computer, uh-huh. I couldn't have been doing better because I saw... Uh, I live out here in Joplin. I live in Sherwood Forest Mobile Home Community in Joplin, Missouri. And I went online this morning and I saw uh, a video, uh, I don't know what you call it, a video show of uh, Congressman Aiken at a town hall meeting. And I think it was yesterday? Um, Tuesday. Yeah, right, right. And he was... Uh, talking about uh, a lynching uh, the Democrats or how the Democrats was getting lynched when they were going back home to talk to their own... Uh, cons- may, I, may I ask where you saw the video? Someone told me it was on the New York Times. Well, of course it was on the New York Times. Are you kidding me? Was That's it? exactly... You, know, you and I both know why it's on the New York Times. Oh, no, I'm asking where you saw it. We have not been able to find it. Oh, you haven't found it? No, we wanted to view it. Well, you should gurgle it, because if you gurgle it, you you can probably find it through the gurgle, because that's what I I think that's what I may have. Someone sent me a link, so that's how I did it. Yeah. Uh, uh I reckon I shoot y'all an email with it, but but what I wanted to say. And Google, what should I Google? If you gurgle uh uh, Congressman Aiken, and then the word Lynch, like like you do to black people, L Y N C H. Okay. Just did it. Let's see what I can find. All right. This call's being recorded. Okay. I mean, I'm telling you, I think they're recording these phone calls as government people, man. They're just all up in my business. I know they're recording it. It's unbelievable. I'm just... Recording your phone call right now? Oh, they always... I think they are, don't you? I mean, they're doing everything else. They're trying to take over... Look, here's what I'm... Uh, the reason that, for me, why that we're de- lynching the Democrats is because they're the ones that are propping up all this... Health care and stimulus and all this other crap anyway. I mean, they're they the ones that are doing this. Yeah. You know, and I'm just saying, look, I don't need your money. I found it. Thank you very much for helping me find it. Li- I live in a 20 by 12 mobile home. Uh-huh. You don't call it a trailer. You call it a mobile home around here. See, that's the difference. It's yeah. 240 square feet, fully loaded, wall-mounted AC. I have an electric stove and an indoor shower. Does it sound like I need help? I think I'm doing just fine. I got a mortgage just like everybody else. I live right here in Joplin. I don't need a handout. I don't need no medical. I do have sugars, but I'm fine. You know, when my feet swell, I don't go crying about it. I prop them up on a stove and I drink. How old are you? I'm 47 years old. I prop them up on a stove and I drink, and that's about the best medicine that money can buy. So don't try to give me a medical doctor from the government coming in with a, you know, gas mask and a you know, a pair of scissors or whatever trying to cut me open and find something wrong with me. I just, I just tell you, I'm just about had it with, with it. And that's why when I saw this video from, from uh, Todd, I thought, now that's a, that is a real American. Because what he's saying is what this country was founded on. Right. May I... Uh, when, when he talks about... I appreciate you helping me find the link. Well, now, hold on. Now, look. Now, I need to make sure... Here's what I need to make sure of. I'm trying to gather support because I'm going, this this video, uh, you know, he said a couple of key words in there that for me are rallying cries. All right? Now, you know what I mean. Hello? No, I, I don't, sir. Well, look, I'm not going to come out and say it direct, but there's a town in Virginia called Lynchburg, right? And he used that word, Lynch, uh... I, he didn't connect a bird to it. But what I'm saying is that, you know, I know some people out here, and we are ready to rally behind that kind of support. Well, I, And I'm looking to see, you know, does the congressman go out to dinner? Well, let me just quickly, can I, can I explain that I did find the link? Sure. I totally understand that you found that link. I want to explain to you what he said. Sure. Sure. And he was advised by the lead Republican leadership in the House of Representatives to say the word lynch. No. No. He was advised to, that there could be problems 
at any town hall meeting. That they were just warning their members that there's been problems on the Democratic side as well as the Republican side at town hall meetings. This is not directed at one side. Right. So he was just telling the Republicans. Right. Wink. He was warning them that there could be issues at town hall meetings. Uh, hey. And it has been here in town. There's been some problems at town hall meetings. Nothing to do with us because these are grassroots groups that have risen up. In Ru- a- now, see what you Now you're talking to me now. See, now look, sweetie. Look, I don't know you. Anyway, uh, but, a well, Democratic blogger. Found this video and has taken it and put it right. up, suggesting that Mr. H. And God and God bless them for doing it. Wants people to get hurt. He does not. Well, wait. Now hold on. Hold on a minute. The fact that we have the freedom, just like you said, to talk. Right. Now hold on though. Here's here's. I, I just need to back up just one second because this is important for me. You're saying he doesn't want people to get hurt. Right, but 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 the word lynch, when he threw that out there, I was like, you know, for me, that's a rallying cry because you know I'm in a club and you know we spell club with a K out here, if you know what I mean, mm-hmm. in Joplin. So I just thought, well, this is about time that someone speak up and start well, talking about how we're going to take this country back. Now, well, Mr. Aiken believes in taking the country back. So. That's well, so do I, and believe me, it, we we took it from the Indians and don't think we can't take it again. Sure. Be honest about this debate, and at the same time... In the same time, if there has to be a lynching or two, so be it. No, what he was saying, he was joking about himself. He was going... Wait, he was joking about himself? Yes. He's going to do an auto... Like a self-lynching? I don't understand what you mean by that. He was not advocating lynching anyone. He was just stating that he should have... He was warned against having a town hall meeting. Well, now you're coming back to the phone. Where'd you step off to? Sound like you went to the restroom or something while you talked to me. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, that's all right. Look, well, look, I think I misinterpreted something here because when I heard him say that word, it's kind of, for me, that's the bat signal. Thank you out there in Joplin. For me, that is the bat signal. Congressman, who's your congressman out there? I'm sorry, I can't hear you. What? Who is your congressman out there in Joplin? Hell, I don't even know. I don't pay attention to that. Congressman Blunt? I don't know. Um, but he would have... Should, should I call him up? Is he more into this than, than Aiken? Because I thought Aiken was was all about it, but uh, it sounds like you're backing off. But what I'm saying oh. is that he would like for you to be part of the debate. Right, to, be, to, come, to, to come there with my buddies. If you have a particular issue you want to, to bring up, right. then you should call your congressman right. where you live and tell him your opinion on the health care issue. Right. Same thing with the senators. And if I let and if I let out, I'll if, let him know right. that you called right out from out in Joplin, and, and just tell that, him that the night tell him give him this message for me. Could I have your name? Sure, my name is Terrence. That's T E R R E N C E. Wait, wait, wait. My pen just just stopped. I apologize. Give me one second. Well, I tell you. Okay, now I'm ready. Terrence, T E R R E N. C, E. Last name Stansbury. Be glad to let him know. You you let him know that the knights in white satin are standing behind him in full force. We are ready and willing, and whatever he needs, we will be there. Well, sir, he he's not interested in that part, but he would like for you to talk to your congressman right. and voice your opinion. That's the freedoms that he's interested in. Thank you so much for sharing your thoughts. All right, l- lynching for all. I, I hear you. No. God bless. God bless America, white America. Thank you. No, 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 no. We don't believe in that, but thank you. Wait, for- hold on. Now, wait a minute. Now, whose office did I call here? Is this a Democrat? Are you a Democrat? No, we're Republicans. But I would thank you very much. And like I said, right. call your congressman. I'll call Ro- Stay out there in Joplin. All right, you too. Lynch him up.